Hello everybody, how are you? I hope everybody is fine and welcome again in this new video uh, which you already know uh, it's subject so you already know that it's about how to search for uh, you need to uh, laptops executable files in their support and in this video we will uh, see also uh, how to extract uh, the binary file from that executable file uh, sometimes it's just uh, extract by uh, winrar and sometimes if you got uh, like uh, if the files you will need to extract it manually using any uh, hxd editor in this uh, video we will see a case as an example in um, uh, telegram it's erabios uh, repair and um, the case is uh, here somewhere so this is the case this one so here the guy is requesting for obvious file someone has already uh, supplied him with the uh, what like what it seems uh, file built i don't know what this guy uses to build this file anyway it's a repair uh, probably of this original file using uh, another uh, BIOS region maybe from uh, support or from other damp don't know what he uses in this case but anyway this file didn't work so I heard the guy replace uh, not working so we can check the replace there view replace we don't have that and here we to replace so let's go back to the case so let's uh, download the file first sorry let's do this save us let's put in bios uh, fixing in telegram bios repair and the name is bad cups as i see okay let's do this rename the file bad cups as is the name of the requester let's save okay so let's now see how to search in in uh, fujitsu support let's go to our browser so here we have fujitsu you just type fujitsu support in google and you open the first result it will be directed to this uh, page here and it's better to use to search by a region if or if uh, you know the region or the place in which the product is based so as i did in here i have asked the gay the guy here in which in which uh, country uh, he is now so as you can see here. and he answers albania so i'm going to use that so let's choose albania here if you don't have the the based country you can uh, go to uh, where let me just you can go here and you can go to 
downloads. So if you don't have the uh, based country or you don't know, so it's better to go to her uh, support and downloads. So let's go there and you select the serial her uh, number, this one. And you just paste your serial number. Sorry, this is not the serial number. This is a hex value which I was previously copying from a file. Let's delete it. Let's go back to Telegram and let's copy the serial number of our request. There it is. Copy select. Let's go back to Jujitsu support and paste there and let's continue like this. So you will uh, get the page in which you will uh, search for your file. So as you can see here, it's Primo P956. That's what we have here. Exactly. It's Primo P956. So let's just select here the system. Uh, in my case, I will uh, select Windows 10. And let's go to this tab of yours here. And you have two options. So usually you will have to choose the first one. And here you have the uh, date dates of release of the update so let's choose the uh, new one which is this one and uh, select direct download and click on it let's wait i don't know why it takes time but i have clicked on direct download but this stops here Let's see what will happen. Okay, we uh, got this in which we have to agree to the terms and conditions. And let's download the file. So let's put it in our uh, working folder, of course, in uh, Telegram Use Repair Backups. Yes, sir. Uh, and uh, we can create another folder which we may name exe simply and let's save the file in it now let's go to our in folder let's just open it from there let's wait for the file to uh, finish download and now we can show it in a folder like this and there we have the file and if we go we go back we have the backup so let's extract the backup here first so this is the backup file and uh, it seems a uh, good file as it has the header and also we have a signature of the bios file in the footer so let's go to exif folder and let's extract here so we got the room as you can see here we got the room it's uh, 8 megabyte let's copy it and move it next to next to original damp here paste so as you can see we have the original damp it's 16 megabyte and the room here is 8 megabyte which sim which simply means that it's the uh, BIOS region so we got only BIOS region from Fujitsu support so we simply have to open both files with any hex editor and you select uh, two or three f lines in the beginning of the BIOS region which you have extracted from the executable file uh, from uh, Fujitsu support so and you can pay those lines like this you go back to the original file here and uh, uh, you search for 
the value which you have copied from the US region like this you select X value you check this and you hit OK so we got a result but you have always tried to see if there's no other result in your file by simply pressing F3 on your keyboard so let me press F3 on my keyboard so no other result which means that this is the beginning of the BIOS region in the original backup so we just mark it like this by clicking here on the so let's do it again Control F okay so we came here at the beginning of the selection here and we click here and we go to the room or the BIOS region with your keyboard Control A uh, and you select the hole you just copy you go back to the original file and there where you have clicked before with your right click you fast write the new BIOS region and you uh, save as uh, let's uh, let's uh, name it new BIOS simple you will see so here we got our new BIOS with 16 megabytes as the original file so we got exact size exact size which means that the file is ready for use and we can check it with UFI tool so we have the uh, exact partitions showing without any uh, issue in the UFI tool which means that's good let's further uh, check with the analyzer and into So we have what we need. Yes, it's initialized. And if you need clean me, you just you do clean me using the flash image tool. This version, if available, if not, use the nearest one. And you use the this uh, same version of me. If not available, use the nearest one. But but you should pay attention to this. Uh, uh, settings also when choosing your me file so this is how we proceed or we uh, search for Fujitsu uh, executable BIOS files in their support I hope it's useful for some who don't know this and uh, see you in the next video and sorry in this video i'm not feeling very good i'm a bit uh, sick and uh, uh, yes we came to the end of the video and if any question any question you can ask me as usual in the comments of this uh, video or in um, telegram groups concerning the group concerning the BIOS repair and if you need any help with BIOS unlock uh, there's also a group for that it's a paid service in fact but with good prices so see you in the next video and uh, till then take care of yourself and bye bye see you soon bye bye Thank <laughs> you.